I'm talking about using the Solgel PCD to jet inkjet print head actuators. Inkjet printing is demanded for application to industrial usage due to the reduction of reduction of environmental load, man hours, and cost in the manufacturing process of uh, in the manufacturing process. It has been practically applied to the industrial pr uh, manufacturing process of liquid crystal display panel. In addition, the application in the field of printed electronics is also expected in the future. PZT, the red zirconate titanate, is a functional ceramics which is used in many devices, which is worked as sensors or actuators. PZT thin film is typically developed by sputtering or spin coating with chemical solution deposition method and patterned by photography, photography etching. But however, PZT is difficult to edge. Direct patterning of PZT film is more suited for film device application. Also, there are some reports on the fabrication of PZT film of, with thickness of submicron order by inkjet printing. There are few reports of the fabrication of thick, thick PZT film which is usable as an actuator. In this study, we tried direct patterning of PZT film with thickness of micron order. <coughs> this is overview of IJP method. The film is made based on chemical solution deposition method, which uses liquid precursor solution, which contains organic metals. Our technical features are there. Liquid repeat, repeat, uh, repeat, repeat, repayment treatment with some IJ head MH2420, which can eject PCT precursor ink and ink formulation, which enables stable jetting. By repeating liquid repayment treatment, inkjet deposition, and annealing, we fabricate two micron thick PZT film by inkjet process. This slide, this slide is about how to control surface energy. Usually, Without surface energy control, we can't find uh, we can't fabricate highly high definition pattern because spread of uh, ink on a metal. So we pattern the surface control of the substrate. This is the cross section of the cross section image of the substrate. The sub silicon substrate has a platinum layer over strontium lucidium oxide, SRO layer, for lower electrode. Platinum layer is partially etched, and SRO surface is exposed there. Then, the substrate is dipped into the ethanol solution of the dodecan tile to form self-assembled monolayer, SAM. Due to the affinity, the sum only forms on the sum of platinum. Where sum forms, the surface energy decreased and highly repayment film is obtained. After the sum coating process, the contact angle of the water is much higher than on SRO, which is hydrophilic.
in, in the in inkjet deposition process, the drops are ejected onto the SRO, which is hydroflake final flake service, and spread uniformly. But in some cases, the drops land on the boundary between hydrophilic and hydrophobic region, like this. But even in that case, the drop moves to the hydrophilic region and spreads uniformly for service energy difference. By controlling service energy of the substrate, ink spreading area is restricted and finally, fine pattern of PTT film is fabricated. This is about inkjet head. We developed several types of inkjet head, which is composed of stainless metal plate. Good points of our heads are higher reliability, erosion resistant, and higher jetting frequency. We used MH2420 type head as shown here. This slide is about PCT precursor ink. To achieve stable jetting, we controlled various parameters of the solution, such as surface tension, surface tension, viscosity, and drying speed. High boiling point alcohol was added to the prime solvent. This is a photography, stroboscopic photograph of droplet ejection. This is a row of the nozzles and they are droplets of the PZT precursor ink. We got the ink that enables stable jetting. Clocking, de deflected ejection, and a change of droplet velocity is prevented. This is about problem which occurs during the development of this method. After the included deposition, the thickness uniformity of the film is high, as shown here. But in the next step, drying process, the film at the edge becomes thick. This phenomenon is called coffee stain effect. According to one theory, the coffee stain effect occurs as follows. In the drying process, first, evaporation continues keeping its shape. Then, concentration of the ink becomes inhomogeneous and ink at the edge becomes concentrated. Con convection flow inside the drop accelerates the, this concentration. Finally, the bank is formed at the edge. It's important to control convection flow inside the drop. They are factors which are said to contribute to the coffee stain effect. We focus attention on composition of the solvent and heating rate, and, and we optimize them. This is conclusion. Uh, 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 thickness at the edge become same as at the center. We successfully con suppress the coffee stain effect. This is the sequence of PZT film formation. We repeated liquid replacement treatment, inkjet deposition, and annealing until desired film thickness is obtained. Some on the platinum disappeared during the drying process, so 
the kit repayment treatment is required every time prior to the increased deposition. Note here, some does not form on PCT like on SRO. The same process as first layer is executed for subsequent layers in the liquid repayment treatment. This is the optical microscope image of patterned PCT film. Repeating this sequence about 20 times. Pattern accuracy is high enough. <coughs> this is cross-section stem image of the, our film. In case of IGP method, the precursor solution is deposited only on the restricted area and dries within that restricted area. So, the film has a cylindrically curved form due to the surface tension of the solution. We define the thickness of the film by that as the thickest point, like this. The center of the film, film is magnified here. We can see there are neither voids nor defects, which indicates good quality of the film. This is PE hysteresis loops and the electric and ferroelectric properties of our films. We can say that the electric and ferroelectric properties of our film are conventional to the uh, comparable to the film that is made by conventional method by spin coating or sputtering. This is a schematic view of discriminant measurement system using laser Doppler velocimeter. To obtain membrane, backside of the silicon substrate is partially etched. The right figure is the membrane displacement properties of IGP PCT film. When 30 volt is applied, the displacement is over 0.1 micron, which indicates that this IGP PCT film can sufficiently work as an actuator for inkjet head. Then we made trial inkjet head using IGP PCT film. This is trial inkjet head using PCT actuator fabricated by IGP method. The right is the stroboscopic photograph of water-based ink ejected from this inkjet head. We confirmed stable jetting. The droplet volume and speed is typical for inkjet head, about 10 picoliter and 10 meter per second. We believe that this IGP method can, is a candidate for piezo memos fabrication. The features of IGP method, including not mentioned today, small consumption amount of raw materials, no need to PCT, no need to HPCT film, and pattern PCT film can be fabricated which have different composition and thickness of the same substrate. And thicker film can be made. As is well known, PCT is used not only for sensor actuators, but also for sensors. PCT has some excellent properties and many types of devices are commercial reality or under development. When PCT is deformed, electric charge is generated. It's called piezoelectric effect. 
and use, used in drug sensor or ultrasonic transducer. And deformation occurs when electric field is applied. It's called inverse piezoelectric effect. And used in actuator for IG head, gyro sense, gyro, and ultrasonic transducer. Electric charge also changes when temperature changes. It's called pyroelectric effect. It's used in infrared sensor. Gyro sensor is already commercial reality and used in car navigation system. IR sensor can be used for human sensing, detecting human heat. Ultrasonic transducer can be used for medical imaging, for example. Our IJP PCT film can be used for this application and also looking for other applications, taking advantage of merits of our film. To consider possible application of IGP PCT film, we tried fabricating various patterns of PCT films. Various shape pattern like square or circle with the size of 30 to 300 micron are successfully fabricated. Different thickness PCT film like 1 micron and 2 micron are also fabricated on one substrate. Appropriate thickness of the film or composition depends on its, its application. In case of ultrasonic transducer, which is sending, uh, both, both sending or receiving ultrasonic signal, for example, we can make different PCT film for sensing part and actuating part. We plan to make PCT film device reflecting these results. This is our conclusion. In our study of fabricating patterned PCT film by IGP method, we obtained substrate with a high contrast surface energy pattern by forming sums on patterned platinum. And by repeating inkjet deposition and annealing about 20 times, we obtained two micron thick PCT film with high patterning accuracy. And we developed fine pattern, finely patterned actuator by simple process using IGP method. And finally, we succeeded in jetting of water-based ink by trial inkjet head using PCT actuators fabricated by IGP method. Thank you. Thank you, Takeuchi san. Uh, probably we still have uh, time for a couple of questions, but first of all, who would have thought that uh, Marie, uh, Pierre, and Jacques Curie would really be the start of all this in uh, Piezo? Piezo was mainstream. And surprisingly, this uh, piezo, of course, uh, is further developed with uh, the new uh, technology that uh, Rico has, making uh, sicker films and applying that also into uh, uh, PZT inkjet heads. Not only in PZT inkjet heads, but you also see infrared and uh, ultrasonic applications. So that uh, was quite a surprise for us, and uh, seeing that uh, piezo is helping out Piezo uh, inkjet hats.